There are things that we do. Things we'd rather do. And then, there are some things we are called to do. To me, it's a fine distinction that I've learned to discern over the course of my life. That the greatest adventure we could possess is distinguishing purpose and letting that still small voice lead us into what we are called to do. Life is in a calendar of obligations we have to manage. It's not being in debt to a fallen realm to work our souls weary. It's a daily renewal to see with amber colored eyes and to fan into flames the fire within us. It's within us. And it's pulling us towards it. If you make truth your mission and love your passion, even in the darkest moments of your life, you will shine like a beacon. So create with your hands. Throw yourselves into your passion and watch how your life will inspire a whole generation.
just remember as a kid, inspiration was endless. Creating was first nature. And there were no rules against passion and excitement continually playing together. But somewhere along the way, we've allowed people to tell us that the gift to make is all make-believe. They turned a gift into an afterthought, an aimless pursuit, a hobby. And if I'm being honest, I lived that lie for a long time. I gave up on my dreams, and tried to fall into the mainstream narrative for my life. But there was this resistance inside of me that wouldn't allow me to compromise forever. It told me, remember that little girl and how we used to play together? Create new things? And how it blessed everyone around you then. That gift isn't gone. If anything, it's greater within you now. And greater heights now you will accomplish than generations before you. That has brought me on a journey I could have never written on my own. I found resolution. With every breath, I am thankful to have the motivation to be and live every day completely limitless. And you can too. Follow the examples of the great overcomers before you. And lay down the life that society has pressed upon you. Become who you truly are. And what you are is the remedy. I pray you come to see this truth for yourself. And if you have, I hope my words continue to confirm within you that you are on the right track. And for those who are still searching, I pray that you come to know the love of your creator so deep that it will begin to make you walk in the greatness that you were purposed for. This world could use you, you know. Strengthen your weary hands and plant your feet firmly in the heart of what matters most. Embrace yourself, because once you're all in, there's no turning back from here. I will never let time, doubt, or demographic hold me back from living a boundless life ever again. There's more I'd like to say, but I'll save it until we so remember to be strong and have the heart of the lion.